t-shirt. Here's Judith Moritz. First there was black and white, then colour. Now satellite and digital are breaking new ground. But in five years' time, even they'll be out of date. The TV of the future is just around the corner. And it looks like this. TV you can wear. It's not quite Teletubby land, but this Cambridge physics lab is the home of the TV on your T-shirt. Scientists have developed a screen made of paint which will spray on. We can print it or spray it or paint it onto whatever surface we want to coat. What we end up with are finely patterned arrays of these thin layers of semiconducting plastic. They're not quite ready to hit the catwalk, though they're not far off. They could be on the shelves within a couple of years, as could wafer-thin screens which roll up. It's all leaving the cathode ray tube far behind. There are things that you could do, for example, inside a car where you could put you know, TV on the dashboard together with lighting, together with all sorts of things. And you combine all these different technologies, which today are expensive and cumbersome. You can combine them all onto one piece of plastic or one piece of glass and make some really innovative products. What started as another Cambridge physics experiment is now attracting worldwide interest from firms such as Philips. It's one idea which won't stay in the lab. So you've bought the satellite dish and the decoder, now buy the t-shirt. In a few years' time, we could all be like Tinky Winky. Judith Moritz, BBC Look East, Cambridge. There goes, she didn't forget Tinky Winky. <laughs> <laughs> in tonight's sport, the golfers are teeing up and the engines are revving up. Well, last night Ian was at Silverstone, tonight he's full of fascinating...